Hello and welcome to WordPress tutorials. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to add uh, two fields in the contact form 7 uh, in one row or in line and also a drop down uh, menu to a contact form 7 form. Okay, uh, please make sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss our future updates. Thank you. Okay, let's start. Uh, for this purpose, I will create a new contact page add new form okay now uh, as you see uh, by default this form will have uh, four fields uh, name email subject and message and of course the send button but uh, that is not a field okay what we are going to do is uh, add a new field called uh, gender as a drop down menu so I will copy the label here and paste it uh, remove this field and change this to gender ok now remove the required also we don't uh, need necessary uh, as it will already select one of them uh, male or female okay click on drop down menu uh, click here within the label uh, tag and click on drop down menu uh, name the field gender or any other uh, you want select options male and in new line female okay that's all insert tag okay there this is the new uh, new form element okay now uh, we will give the ID or class to these two fields uh, to make them in line okay embed div class is equal to frm name or any name you want but uh, you must use within the CSS the exact name div close okay we have this one and do it same with this one too div class frm email and close the div here okay uh, now save the form okay first uh, you will save this form and then come to this e uh, this mail tab uh, because we have added a gender uh, new new field and we don't have uh, it embedded in the form yet in the email yet click on the mail this is uh, what the mail will be received in your inbox and here uh, where it received when a user uh, submit the contact forms then uh, you will receive it with this email I I put a demo email here uh, because this is not a li live site okay in the message body uh, you can see that name email and message and subject these are all are embedded but there is no gender uh, in uh, in this area uh, after saving the form you will see a gender here so click on this right click and copy and paste it here and give it the title gender and then male or female will be appeared here okay click on save uh, we are done with the form now copy this short code click here right click and copy now for pages click on add new page for the custom land for the custom uh, contact us page Okay, here uh, type the 
title or name of the page custom contact us and in the body click on short code and paste that short code which we just copied from the forms publish this page and view page okay as you can see that uh, this is already aligned it's, it's because uh, I already uh, added the code to the customizer uh, first let's, let me remove that and I'll show you from the start You will need this customizer uh, to add or remove the CSS from uh, any page. Click on additional CSS. I remove this. Okay. Now you can see that uh, the form we just added uh, is just a plain form, and these two fields are not uh, in line. Now, right click on this one inspect element and uh, the parent div use the class uh, from the parent div for example this one which we added in the contact form copy this class come to this additional CSS uh, type dot and then paste that for, uh, form name or the class name okay uh, first of all type float left and then uh, type width is equal to 48% or you can give it max width 48% copy the same and paste it here and type uh, change the name to for frm email uh, so uh, we will do it for the same here email and you can see it's already there but uh, instead of float left we will be using float right so you can see it's here uh, but now uh, as you see the gender is uh, floating here while the field is here so now come to the the next one the gender field we will give the ID to the gender field as well form here div class frm gender and close div save the form and uh, publish the page here and refresh the customizer so that uh, the class has been loaded to this field okay now click on refresh this page to additional CSS okay now you will see that uh, when you right click here then the class will be applied the FRM gender class will be applied to this uh, gender field as you can see FRM gender okay now copy this class come to the customizer 
dot and paste that clause uh, type clear both and you can see that gender is uh, in place now okay now uh, this width is not uh, we need so remove the max width and just type the width and then you will see that the form is uh, ac accurately uh, what we wanted in the start so that was the video uh, if you like it then please uh, subscribe to our channel uh, so you will not miss any future update thank you